First thing we're going to do is check your exhaled CO2. And we went into the office and the neurologist said, your son has Duchenne muscular dystrophy. He's probably going to stop walking between 8 and 10 and then his heart and lungs are going to go and you're going to lose him anywhere from 12 to 20. Anthony said that he wanted to get to the bottom of the Grand Canyon and put his feet in the river. My immediate thought was, that's crazy. So I went to Daring Adventures and I said, I want to borrow that hiking chair. I want to get my kid to the bottom of the Grand Canyon. I think a few of them were like, wow, that's really, really crazy. <laughs> you know? Then you meet Anthony and he kind of turns you definitely into that positive thought process. Instead of people saying, you can't do this, they were saying, how can we help you do this? And then I came out a couple times and worked with them and saw what they had going on and it was, it was the real deal. Was the family ready for what they were gonna what they were going to do. A lot of people don't really understand what it takes to get into the canyon and, and to get out of the canyon. No one was really even sure this was going to be, be doable. I just don't think any of us get through this lifetime unscathed. And I think that the hero is the one in the midst of all that that can stay true to themselves and have some grace and courage and uh, ride the storm. You can't ever squash anyone's will who's willing. Anthony is an amazing young boy. I mean, I talk about him every day, literally every day. It's, it's changed me. This came for a higher purpose of making sure that we focus on what he can do, not what he can't.